So, let me ask this question. Who can be creative? He just wants you to say, everyone. Behave yourself now. So today we're asking the question, who can be creative? Of course, everybody can be creative. Yep, told you. It may just take some people a bit more time to find their process, right? So tapping into the creative process starts with four main building blocks, all right? Are you ready? Here we go, number one. Where are you creating? Not so much a party, more than a, a playground, because play is at the epicenter of creative thought. Number two, what is your process? If you don't have one, let's find one. Because most people don't realize that resourcefulness is also a huge part of creativity. A very small percentage of the population pull out those million dollar ideas out of thin air, right? The best ideas are found in collaboration. Number three, how do you learn best? And we'll be looking at the wheel of senses to help you figure out in a very organic way. Yes. Number four, what is hindering your ability to create? What baggage have you brought to the table with you? What filters were placed in you as a child, yeah? Are there addictions that are stealing your time? These could be slowing you down, stealing your mojo. But before we dive in, let's free our minds up by doing some exercises. No, 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 no need to roll out your yoga mat. No, these are all just mental exercises. Sorry. Well, it's gonna be hard. First of all, do you see any animals in this picture? How many? Two, three, four? Yes, there are five. And when you feel yourself focused to identify something, that is you leaning in to be creative. All right, here we go. Do me a favor and read this word. Ready? Okay, now that there's another word there. Do you see that word? All right, now with just your mind, switch between the two. You see one? How about two? One or two? <laughs> All right, these are not optical tricks as much as they are a challenge for your mind to see more than one perspective. And that, my friend, is a critical skill in creativity looking at one thing and seeing many things. Because you can see with your eyes, but you perceive with your mind. And because you have this ability, it's easy to see that our, our eyes act like a lens, like a camera, which enables our brains to be the artist and paint. Now, what I'm gonna ask you to do is think differently. Okay, well, I'm not gonna ask you, I'm gonna show you. I am gonna take the mystery out of the creative process. Next time on Creative Thought Design. We're gonna do 10 perspective exercises. Get ready, take a deep breath. 